My name is Maddie. Um, this is a quick little mini sculpt class uh, with a focus on a little booty, a little biceps. Um, so yeah, there's a link to the playlist attached below this video. Um, it's just called Fun Size Sculpt, I believe. Yeah, so if you wanna have that queued up and ready to go, um, all you'll need is you, maybe a mat if you have one, but totally not necessary, and then some weights. But if you don't have weights, you can always use wine bottles or canned goods or just use the resistance of your own muscles, and that's totally fine. So have the um, playlist queued up. Um, we're not gonna start just yet, but come on down to your back and we'll start from there. Set your spine down on the earth. Bring your feet to the outer edges of your mat and then knock the knees in towards one another. So your inner thighs kiss. And then one hand to heart, one hand to belly. And before you blink your eyes closed, we're gonna start that playlist all together, okay? In a count of three, two, one, press play. Sink down really heavy into your bones. Have those weights either side of your mat, just so they're handy, but for right now, no need. Notice your breath, the quality of the inhales, the quality of the exhales, how you're doing, how you're feeling. And as you lie here, you start to deepen the breath. Take an inhale from the soles of your feet. Track it the length of your spine, all the way to the back of your throat, to the crown of your head. And open your mouth, let it go, exhale. Now this time a little less expectation, okay? Inhale, fill up. And track it up, let it get wide, expansive through the chest, through the belly, all the way up to the back of your throat, and then pause. And open your mouth with a big sigh. And ask yourself again, how are you doing? How are you feeling? And be really honest about that answer. Tired, grumpy, sad, happy, ecstatic. It doesn't really matter, but you made it here to your mat. So be proud of that. And one more time all together. Take an inhale, fill up. And let the rest go. From here, I invite you to keep your eyes soft. Gently open the knees, keep the feet, the width of your mat, and then make a little goal post 90 degrees with the arms. Start to windshield wiper your legs a little bit side to side. If you need to adjust the feet a little bit wider, that's totally cool with me. Back of your head heavy. And try not to grip, yeah? But if you are, notice where it is coming from, and then let it go. The next time you drop the knees to the left, bump the hips over to the right and let the knees fall staggered. As you drag the right shoulder blade down into the earth, maybe, just maybe, you feel open enough already. Cross left ankle on right thigh. Feel the length on your right hip go forward. The traction of your spine. Now we've been here, can you soften through the fingertips, the palms? Take an inhale breath. An easy exhale to let it go. And one more time, fill up. Release. If you've had that left foot crossed, just uncross it. Plant the feet, bring the knees back through center, bump the hips to the left this time. Drop the knees over to the right, feel the length on the front of your left quad and maybe that right ankle hook. So, Notice your body where the muscles are at coming into this practice today. It's gonna be quick, so I want you to take really good care of your body and notice what's pinchy, what needs a little extra love, and then you tend to it. You adjust, you pivot, and it's all good. Take a breath in. Take a breath out. Gently slide that right foot off of your left thigh. Plant the feet, come through center. Make sure the spine is long on the earth. Keep the feet the width of the mat and now turn your toes out just slightly so you find external rotation through your hips. Grab for those weights nearby and then stack them up so the heads of the weights are pressing down into the earth. Your palms are pressing into the heads. Take an inhale, breath. And as you exhale, squeeze from your glutes. Lift your hips up nice and high. Inhale, lower tap. Exhale, squeeze to lift. Again, inhale down. 
Exhale, belly presses up. Take it down. Exhale, squeeze. Now just keep moving. You're warming up the muscles. Yeah, outer glutes, base of your glutes, outer thighs, inner thighs, the back of your triceps with that heavy press on top of the weight. Just notice, take an inhale. And exhale, lift it up. One more time, take it down. Exhale, squeeze to lift, pause right here. Just little pulse up and up. So notice if your gaze has started to wander, maybe you've rolled side to side with the neck. Can you press the back of your head down once again? It's all good. Just to protect the cervical spine, make sure it's nice and long. Again, lift, go up and up. Let a fire start to burn in your backside. Yeah, give me eight. That's seven, six, five, four, three, two on one. Pause, stay parallel the feet and then walk them in a little bit closer. So they're about hips width distance. If you need to adjust the heels a little closer and you do that, now grab onto those weights, send them forward, back of your arms, hover palms, face up, take an inhale, tap the hips, exhale, squeeze, lift the hips and curl the arms. Again, inhale to lower, go slow. Exhale, lift it up. Now option, take it to the beat. Let's go. Down, exhale, lift. You lower, exhale, squeeze. So getting those biceps, tops, inner arms involved, yeah. Press through the soles of your feet, so good. Down and up, down and up. Full articulation through the entire arm bone, yeah. Go down, exhale, squeeze weights to shoulders for four. That's three, wrap those inner thighs in and down for two, my loves. On one, listen close, hips up, lengthen the arms, lift up and up so you have a micro bend in both elbows you're pulsing up with the hips you're also pulsing up with the biceps relax those shoulders let them root down go up and up spread your toes really wide feel all four corners of the feet on the earth let that be your anchor yeah and then come back to the breath close your eyes for this last eight that's seven pulse go six that's five breathe for four three two on one, pause at the top, drop your weights either side of your mat. Lift high up of the heels, take a breath in. And as you exhale, slowly roll down one backbone at a time. Whoo, feels nice, yeah? Rock the knees a little bit side to side before you pull them into your chest. When you feel ready, set to go, yeah? Pull the knees in, collect there. Take a leg grip behind your thighs if you feel good. Start to rock and roll up and down the length of your spine. Just go a few passes, rounding the upper back, maybe chin to chest. One more time, just like that. Massage at the back body. Cross of the ankles, use that momentum, move into a tabletop pose. Hands under shoulders, knees underneath your hips. Spread the fingertips really wide, be confident in your base first. Now as you inhale, dip the belly low, lean the chest forward, arch out the spine. Maybe you look up, take a breath in. And as you exhale, press to the palms, chin to chest, eyes to thighs, dome and run. Slow, intentional. Inhale, move forward, crack open the heart. Next exhale, chin to chest, round, tuck your tail between your thighs. One more time, inhale, move forward, track the shoulders down your back. Next exhale, lead with the belly, round it out. Neutralize from here, yeah? Tuck the toes, lift the knees up to a hover. Take a breath in here. Exhale, pike it up and back, downward facing dog. Pedal up the knees a little bit side to side. And let's get right into it. Shake that head out, yes. Shake your head out a little bit, no. Pause where you are, deep breath in. And open mouth, exhale. Lift the heel, soft bend through the knees. Tiptoe your way to the top of your mat. Bring the weights along with you. All right, heavy forward, full top of the mat. Bend into all the joints. Often grab opposite elbows. And you sway just a little to decompress the spine before we go any further. Now come through center. Fingertips on shins, inhale, lengthen halfway wraps. Next, exhale, soften down, forward fold, Uttanasana. Go again like that, inhale, peel yourself up, shoulder blades roll down. Next, exhale, let it go. Last one, three times the charm. Inhale, roll back through the triceps, lean forward. Next, exhale, let it go, soften the knees, roll up bone by bone. All the way to the top. When you get there, roll the shoulders up, back, and down, create space across the heart. Reach the arms forward and then up. Maybe palms kiss, maybe gaze up. Squeeze the booty, take an inhale. And as you exhale, dive it down, forward fold. Hands pass through heart center, grab for those weights. 
Take an inhale, bring the weights to your chest. Exhale, lift the heart, bend the knees. You're low in this chair, but your feet are still hips with distance. Keep it like that. Let's start with a pulse. Down, down. Little pulse and pulse. So there's a beat in this music, yes? I'm offering that to you. But if it feels a little chaotic, if it feels too fast, you slow it down, yeah? Beautiful, get lower. Down and down. Roll the shoulders down. Low belly picks up. Next one, we slow it down. Inhale, down. Exhale, squeeze to lift down all the way up if you need to take the feet a little bit wider by all means you do so go down we're gonna add on in just a second so start to shift some more weight to your right foot get confident there left knee comes up go down exhale squeeze down exhale squeeze getting that low belly yeah arms just staying put notice that a little more weight on the top of the abs Next one, add an extension left leg. Go down, press extend, squat, lift, yeah. So that right booty cheek. If it starts to burn, it's holding nearly your entire body weight up. For three, for two, on one, pause stay. Left leg long. Reach your weights either side of your hips. Keeping that left leg floating, soften the right knee, tip the weight back. You move through kind of this warrior three deadlift situation. Yeah? Now as you inhale, tip your weight forward, tap the weights. Exhale, squeeze to lift all the way up. Inhale, lower tap. Exhale, squeeze to lift. So keep that spine nice and long. One line, crown of head to back of left heel. The more you bend that right knee, the more forgiveness you offer that right back. So do it. Give yourself permission to bend it. Give me three more. <laughs> Give me two more. Last one, pause at the bottom. Press the weights down underneath the shoulders. Left leg high, chest still grazing forward. Cross left leg behind, right inhale. Exhale, lift it back up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift it up. Option, speed this up now. Go down, exhale, squeeze. Down, exhale, squeeze. Really press into those weights. Try to level off the pelvis for four, three, two, on one, hold the left leg up and back, little lifts and lifts. Go up and up, yes, crushing it. Chin away from chest, jaw unclenched for four, three, two, on one, pause. Move the weights back slightly. Bend your right knee, step the left toes back of your mat. Drop the left knee, untuck the toes. My loves, lift the chest, weights to heart. Elbows in, palms up, curl, extend. Curl, extend. So notice your base. Press into that right big toe mount. Lengthen out your right side body. Now can you spill forward a little bit more? Let the left hip flexor open as we burn out these biceps, yeah? Exhale, shh, then out. Exhale, shh, then out. Whew, find a pace. Maybe you close your eyes and I ask you again, how are you doing? How are you feeling? Honor that, then we moved. Here's five. That's four. Breathe with me, three. For two, on one, pause. Weights to chest. Send that right knee back. You're standing on your shins. Knees slightly wider than the hips. Toes back behind you. Maybe you curl the toes under if that feels better for you. I'm going to leave them untucked. It just doesn't feel right for me. It's all good. Now lengthen your arms forward on that low diagonal. Palms face towards your thighs. Take an inhale as you tap your hips down. Exhale, reverse curl. Squeeze, lift the butt. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift it up. Take it your pace, maybe faster. Down, exhale, squeeze. Down, exhale, squeeze. Hinging at the elbows, chest lifted, shoulders over hips. Go down, shh, down, shh. That's eight, seven, squeeze, six, shh. Five elbows forward more for four. You got it, stay with me for three. That's two, on one, pause. Set the hips down, knees wide. Drop the weights either side of the mat. Reach the arms forward, child's pose. Forehead curve. Rock the forehead a little side to side. Whew, you made it first side. Come through center pause. Take a breath into your back body. 
and open mouth exhale let it go and one more time breathe in and open mouth exhale let it go and when you feel good Feel the hips off of your heels, move forward, tabletop, adjust the knees if you need to. Tuck the toes, lift the knees, let it hover, breathe in. And exhale, downward facing dog, set it up and back. Shake your head, yes, one more time. Shake your head on, no. Lift the heels, micro bend, walk to the top of the mat, bring the weights with you. Let's hit this last side, yeah? Fingertips to shins, inhale, lengthen, halfway rise, Arda. Next, exhale, let it go. Grab those weights. Take an inhale, weights to your chest. Exhale, bend the knees. Lift up, little pulse. Down, down. Pulse, pulse, yeah. You've been here before, so feel a little stronger for it. Down, down. Yeah, it's so good. Slow it down. Take an inhale, bend. Exhale, lift. Go down, exhale, squeeze. Nice. Chest proud, gaze in front of your journey. Add that right knee to the chest. Down, down. You slow it down if you need to, honor your body. Yeah, feeling it. Next one, add that extension. Squat, extend. Squat, extend the leg. Kick the door open, yeah? Feel the quad to the back of your left glute. Here for four. That's your three. Here for two. On one, hold. Right leg long, arms by the side. Tip the right leg back, move through warrior three. Micro bend left knee, inhale forward. Exhale lift, deadlifts, go forward. Exhale squeeze. Nice. Square those hips down like headlights. Shoulder blades contracting. Those up dog muscles, yeah? Right where your angel wings would be. For four, squeeze to lift, my loves. Here for three, let things start to happen, yeah? This is two. Last one, hold the weights down. Cross right leg behind left. Go inhale, exhale lift. Go down, exhale squeeze maybe faster. Down, lift, down, lift. Back or right butt cheek. Low belly picks off left thigh, yeah. Hang on with me. That's four, three, here for two. On one hold, little lifts. Go up, 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 up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two on one, pause. Move the weights back, bend the left knee, step the right toes back, mat. Drop the knee, untuck the toes, lift up, weights to heart center. Elbows into your waistband, palms facing, little robot arms, we're almost there, exhales. You curl, then lengthen, exhale, squeeze. Then down, move to your beat. Reestablish your base. Connect back with your intention. This is a practice that feels personal, yeah? Because it is. Squeeze to lift. Here's four. That's three. Here for two, stay with me. On one pause, step the left knee back, drop the weights, knees wide, toes to kiss, arms extend forward. You made it. Deep breath into your lungs. Open mouth, exhale, let it go. And one more time, breath in. Open mouth, side out. Gently crawl the fingertips back, roll up one bone at a time. Sit your hips to one side. Lengthen your legs in front of you. Hip width distance apart, flex your feet. Just a moment of pause, cross the right arm across your chest. Left hand grabs, avoid the elbow. Sit well. Inhale. And easy exhale, it's quick, yeah I know. So can you settle back in? And gently let that go, right hand between the shoulder. Grab on left hand, right elbow, you side bend. Lift the chest, gently switch, left arm across. Grab on with your right hand, avoid that elbow. Maybe you soften your gaze, you let those eyelashes flutter close. 
release that left hand between the shoulders, grab on with the right, side bend up and over. And deep breath in. And then a long exhale out. And let it go, lift the chest, keep the feet hip width, just bump your hips forward, reach the arms, extend, palms face up to the sky with intention, slow to your back for four, for three, and that's two. On one, let it go, hug the knees into the chest, give yourself a hug. And set the feet down, bump the hips to the right. Once again, drop the knees, left arms out. Maybe you tee, maybe you goal post, maybe you stagger the legs. But maybe you just notice a difference, yeah. Has something shifted? Has your energy moved? You feel lighter. Breath in. And breath out, navel able to spine, bring the knees through center, bump the hips to the left, adjust as you need, knees to the right, arms out. Just let it be. Be honest about where you're at. And then go from there. Breath in, breath out. Knees back through center. Wrap your arms around your shins, forehead to knees, shoulder blades up high, squeeze like crazy. Take an inhale, fill all the way up. And let it go. Release your legs to the corner of your mat. Arms by side, palms up, eyes closed, heart wide open. Just stay here, we're not here forever, yeah? Just a few breaths. Settle back in. And as you release what you're still holding on to, inhale, fill up. Open mouth, gentle exhale. And last one is if it's just for you, take a deep, long inhale breath. Sigh it out. Stay where you are. Left hand to your heart, right hand to the belly. Right at the navel. And take this time. Give yourself some gratitude, some love, some appreciation for carving out even what was just this really quick time to practice for you. To practice letting go, to practice opening up, gathering strength, holding it all in, whatever it is for you. I'm so glad that you made it to your mat today, yeah? And so one more inhale as a community. Sweet, exhale, let it go. This divinity, light and love within me. This is the very same in you. Namaste. Thank you so much for joining me, friends. Um, yeah.